Hello friends, my name is Ghost Raven, and let me welcome you back to my gameplay to my let's play of the Assassin's Creed 1. I hope you're having a good day, but if you don't, don't worry, the things will get eventually better and you will get through anything, trust me, okay? Right now, just sit back, relax, enjoy, and let's get into this, let's resume session. And yeah, we're back in the MSCF, with our friends in here, with our ladies, hello there. And yeah, we're going to kill our next target in Damascus, I think. Oh, what is going on here? Training. Well, there's something I want to train or get the hang of. I believe the guard break was the name of the thing I should find out. What is it all about? Oh, sure I can. Yeah, defense breaks. Yeah, let's let's see. What is it all about? I don't remember, actually. Okay. So press left mouse button right after step. Okay, how can I step? Oh with a space button. Like this. Alright. That wasn't too hard, but thank you. Thank you, trainer. Exit tutorial. Uh, last one. Oh yeah, you betcha. I know everything. <laughs> I don't need these tutorials anymore. Yeah, let's fast travel to Damascus. And to the bureau. The same thing as always. Should you enter a fist fight, guards will not enter. Yeah, that's a cool point, actually. That guards will not intervene when you're beating someone with fist. Well, <laughs> if you're not beating guards, that is, but yeah, anyway, it's a cool system, really. But yeah, the same thing as always. We're going to synchronize all the views and save all the civilians, which could help us in later stages. This is our last visit to Damascus, so we should. So we should make best of it, and make most of it, I guess, or so many archers. This doesn't look too good, but anyway, I will continue in my discussion, I think, or my monologue about free-to-play Assassin's Creed games. I mean, well, this is a good way to kill the time, but if you don't want to see it, I created timestamps on a video. Be careful of the spoilers, but yeah. I'm trying to stay as, as spoiler free as I can in them, but well, you never know. So, <laughs> that's about it. But anyway, I want to talk about those free to play Assassin's Creed games and about Rebellion, that is, which is actively in development. It's still rather new, I would say. And. The model that it's using, well, I don't like it too much. You know, I should probably talk about the game itself. What can you do in the game, but... Yeah, I will. I will. <laughs> it's hard to focus on talking and fighting at the same time. Yeah, but in the game itself, you can create your own brotherhood. And basically hire your own assassins. Some of which come from other games, the official Assassin's Creed games, some of them which are new to the franchise. The game is not canon in any way as far as I can tell, although one of the main characters, at least at the beginning, is the character from the Assassin's Creed movie, and I forgot his name. Michael Fassbender is, is staring at him in the movie, so... But, yeah, the game itself is not, not canon. Will they find me? Oh, they did. But the game itself, it plays like a strategy game in a way. You know, you go on a different missions and killing your enemies, accomplishing different goals like stealing stuff, killing higher profile targets. And it sounds good on the paper, believe me, I mean. And it's fun for 
some time, at least at the beginning, but after... Oh, come on, don't... Don't you fight me. Oh, come on, I didn't do anything. Yeah, so it's fun for a couple of hours, but after that you will start to see the repetition and the problems this game has, major ones. Especially with the system, how the microtransaction and how overall progress is introduced in the game. So anyway, you get many different assassins that you can hire, I believe over 100 in today's day and age. In, well, this time, in the middle of 2021. Surely more will be on the way. <laughs> but yeah, and you can upgrade these heroes with DNA fragments. Well, how can you get these fragments? Either from special missions or during the special promotional events, which usually last like two to three days, I believe. Yeah, only today, like, one of these events ended. And it was centered around the Assassin's Creed Odyssey in a way. I don't know if it was loosely based or anything, but yeah. It followed some story maybe, which is featured in a Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I don't know, I didn't complete this, that game just yet. But yeah, but you can unlock different heroes for these DMA fragments and you can get them like this through completing missions and actually ranking in a international ranking system <laughs> of different brotherhoods and yeah the amount of DNA fragments or I don't know how they are called actually for some of those legendary characters is absurd really there are DNA missions which you can do every day, but you can do every mission only three times a day. You know, they will stay in game forever. You can, so you can, in theory, get nine DNA points or fragments like this. But some of those higher rate characters need, like, I don't know, over 300 DNA fragments or even more to unlock to their fifth level fifth star level if you if you will and that can get pretty tiring and pretty obnoxious you know doing the same thing over and over again I understand that games like these are built on a repetition to some aspect and they are built to the uh, for the longevity of itself you know, I've been playing this game in and out for over two years, I believe. Well, and I still haven't unlocked any character, legendary character, to its full potential. And that's a problem, at least for me. I, I don't like it. That I need to spend so much time, or money, because there are premium packs, which could save you a lot of trouble and premium currencies to make this process faster but while well, you can get these these premium currencies these helix I don't know how they are called maybe fragments also I don't know I I'm not really sure but you can get pretty much um or oh, too many of them not too many, but pretty many of them during your free game. You know, I never spent any money on Assassin's Creed Rebellion, not even one, one cent. And yeah, you can you can earn them pretty fast, but unfortunately, you need so many of these credits to unlock different loot boxes to even have a chance to to get. DNA fragments for these different heroes, it's its getting out of hand. And when you take into account that currently in the game there's over 100 different heroes which you can unlock while unlocking them to their final form 
which is the only form that matters really in the end game because there's so much level gating it becomes absurd in the later stages like for example I I cannot get to the region 5 I should talk about this the game is separated to five regions and each of them each of those regions has five story missions which are slightly different slightly more unique to the basic experience but getting there well you have to get through so much repetition so much grinding and level gating well it's become absurd I mean my brotherhood it's already at its maximum level but still I cannot beat the last mission of the region 4 in order to well get to it I got like I don't know how many 30 or 40 heroes which were more common in quality which are on a 5 level but simply on their own terms they are not strong enough to tackle those missions you need either epic or legendary assassins or associates to beat these missions and it becomes truly unfair and artificial difficult I mean you can earn like basically I don't know how come on you will talk to me oh no I'm still wanted you can earn these DNA fragments pretty easily but when there are so many of them well it takes a long time to to unlock something sustainable and yeah the main thing that really grinds my gears is the fact that some of these heroes cannot be unlocked through the usual means to the repetition but only during some limited events like for example I believe his name is Darius uh, I don't want to spoil anything and I will not because I don't even played the DLC from for the Assassin's Creed Odyssey yeah that's the one where Darius was so but he was a no main oh there's a flag main not character but your main companion or something like that in the DLC oh man and yeah, he can only be unlocked as far as I can tell during this ev during this event, which usually only takes like three days, real life days. I mean, I've done my best over these three days because I have him on a level four, and I need like 70 more fragments to unlock him. But yeah, I play this game extensively during these three days and still gain like 60. Helix credits or DNA fragments. I don't know what I call them, probably talking gibberish <laughs> about those names. I'm not quite sure. And it takes absurdly long time to to unlock. It's so much level gated that it becomes laughable. I mean it's it truly Truly grindy, like one of the most grindy games or the grindiest games <laughs> I ever played. It's got to be in there because, yeah, not being able to unlock at least one legendary character over the period of two years while well, it's getting out of the control. And for example, I don't want to spoil anything, but you get one character. In the Assassin's Creed of Berlin, for which you can only get DNA fragments through the different achievements, and some of those, oh come on, are you shooting at me, and some of those achievements are so time-consuming that it's become laughable. Once again, I'm using that word a lot, but yeah, it could have been a good game, but some of the systems are truly unfair and truly built to waste as much of your time or pay as much money as you as you are willing to pay for example in order to get DNA fragments for that character 
right now, if I want to get next DNA fragments, I have to, for example, pick 1000 locks. Oh, I mean 5000 locks. 5000 locks, or, you know, disarm 5000 traps, or something like that. And during one mission, you can only... Well, depends on the mission, really, but in some of them, like, are, like, four, three, in some, only one. Well, and... <laughs> And you can do your math and you will see it's it's outrageous. It's a fun game, I like to play this in a little while. I from time to time actually I got these periods during the year when I will be playing this game extensively for like a week or two a month, and then stop for a month or two. Because I get so tired of the whole repetition. And it goes like this over again. To be honest, I'm only playing this game because it's the Assassin's Creed game. If it was any other, I don't know if, if I had a stomach or persistence to, to go on like this. Because, yeah, it's, it's too grindy. And also, the overall gameplay is not so much about your skill, about your strategic options, but about probability. I mean, if you play games like um, XCOM or something like that, and you can see the probability to hit your target, to disarm a tramp, to jump over the obstacle and something like that, well, everything is luck-based. You get the percentage Mm, which will advise you whether you should take or not take this action, but unfortunately I found out that it's actually <laughs> going against you in many aspects. Aspects, I mean the highest amount of probability for accomplishing different tasks like killing the enemy and jumping over obstacle and everything like that is 95, but I got so many instances when I would just fail the action and fall to my death or I would get killed by the enemy because well the game decided to because the game wants to track you to to buy more look boxes to create stronger characters to upgrade everything by the way yeah, I should talk more about this crafting system too, which is in the game. You can craft different weapons and different armor pieces and different other additional means of you know, defending yourself or boosting your attack. But the crafting prices, and especially when I'm talking about resources, it's so freaking high that it's become laughable. I mean, it takes multiple days, even weeks, to accumulate over 500,000 gold pieces. You've got treasury, which will accumulate constantly, you know, gold for you, I believe. It's like, you will get like one gold per minute, I believe. But you know, those legendary items, which only specific characters can use. I mean, those are like half million price each or something like that. And I'm not even counting the basic materials which you need, which are also legendary and only can be gained from the higher rate missions, which you cannot do because you don't have strong enough character to do it in the first place. You know, it's, it goes for a circle. Circle, yeah. And it's it can get tiresome. And another thing which I don't like about that. You know, I got Cassandra on level 4. Since I was trying to get her to the max level for a long time. Yeah, I, and I wanted to give her her legendary weapon. I don't know what it is actually, but yeah, so I spent like half million of my coins, exhausted my resources, 
and I cannot equip it because I need her on level 5 or level 50 <laughs> because you don't only get like these 5 star levels of oh man come on <laughs> that was that was rude but also you need to train your character to increase his power in a training room and you will train your your character through the codex letters and that's another point where it can get absurd getting your character to level 50 it takes so much so much of these codex pages and codex books which once again it's getting ridiculous now the Templar are dead yeah there's so much level gating and so much obvious pay to win procedures that it's quite unfair unfortunately it could have been you know nice little game which you could have played from time to time and have fun but it's like that I don't know uh, Star Wars game I believe that's the one which has similar system to this Galaxy of Heroes or something like that I don't know I'm not that big of a fan of these games as I said that one disappeared I don't know why oh come on I will kill you it's faster to kill you anyway so it's it's really really sad are you in here? oh no you're not I need to get out of here synchronize this view and when I read different posts on the reddit page dedicated to Assassin's Creed Rebellion I also found out the game is very very buggy yeah experience some of those bugs none of which was game breaking uh, game breaking ground breaking but anyway game breaking but yeah what I've heard and what I read man what the hell leave me alone leave me alone it can be truly devastating I heard about you know corrupted saves which I will probably lose my mind if something like that happened to me after so much time I spent in that game and things like that the rewards not showing up the DNA fragments not working and things like that so and in every upgrade it seems like one thing gets fixed and another bug appears so it's a real shame yeah so <clears throat> it's hard to me to to really decide if I recommend it or not because there are some interesting elements it can be fun but also it can be so boring and tedious so yeah I don't really know I guess if you're a diehard Assassin's Creed fan you'll enjoy it to at some point or if you like these types of games like the Star Wars one or different I, I believe Marvel has similar game or DC so well go for it try it but uh, yeah these aspects these drawbacks don't allow me to enjoy it as much as I would like to because you know the graphics wise and things like that the game is very nice I mean I like the, this cartoony style of things you know like these miniatures different almost like every assassin looks like a toy like a caricature of themselves even though they appeared in a Assassin's Creed games but yeah it it just isn't too fun in the long term come on guys so many of you where's the other one get out of here come on come on yeah so that's about that's about it that's my two cents about that game I mean yeah it's 
It's average. I would, I would describe it as, as average. Again, it's a shame, but well, what can you do? So anyway, the last, last synchronizational activity, <laughs> last viewpoint. Oh, another flag. Nice. Oh, there's the, there's the viewpoint. Well, who, who is aiming? Oh, I couldn't hit you from here. Well, I will. I will kill you like this. There you go. And then synchronize the final view. And finally get into... Oh, there's another flag. And finally get into the investigation to find out who do we have to kill. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Come on, get in there. No, no, don't you fall down. Oh, man. <laughs> Are you drunk or something? Man. Come on. Well, at least I will take this flag with me. Y yeah, I know. Come on, climb, man. Who's aiming at me? Are you? You are! Get out of here. Come on and climb. You can do this. You can do this. Yeah. You see? A little confidence boost. No, but anyway. All viewpoints in Damascus cleared. Yeah. And where's the bureau? Here. Okay, that's done. Well, let's get back. Well, let's get out of here. To begin our investigation, as I already said. Yeah, I decided this is the best way how to do things. I would say. Like, do with the whole investigation, doing all those things in one video. Because I was deciding whether I should keep it in here or delete it, but you know, I want to keep everything I do in the game available to watch. And so, yeah, I decided to create timestamps on the videos. And for those who don't want to see this, well, can just jump through this and go into the investigational activities or the assassination itself or whatever your heart desire <laughs> desires. So anyway, there's the entrance on the roof once again. Let's talk to Rafik. Jump in here and yeah, hello there. It's the hero of Damas. Come in, stay a while. Tell me all about your adventures. I'm afraid I don't have the time. I see. Too important for me now. It's not that. No, no, of course not. How may I serve you then? Al Muallam has asked I take the life of the one they call Jubair. Ah, Salah Adin's chief scholar. Strange choice of target, in my opinion. But who are we to question the master's will? I'm sure he has his reasons. Then you're familiar with the man. He's been quite busy these past few days, organizing the scholars and sending them into the streets to preach. What do they speak of? Light and fire, cleansing sins, apocalyptic nonsense, if you ask me. All this talk of paths and a new world. What about this new world? Couldn't say, I don't pay attention to the ramblings of madmen. Much too busy with real work. Very well. I'll walk among the people, see what I can learn. Where would you suggest I search? South of here, you'll find an academy and a guard tower. They're both good places to search. There's also a hospital to the east you might want to visit. I'll begin at once. So eager. You've certainly changed, and for the better, I might add. No, thank you. People changed in time. It's just how life goes, I guess. But let's let's find out which activity is the closest one to me. Well, two of them are. There's a former rooftop race, race challenge. Interesting. Merchant stands, distraction. You know what? Let's do the rooftop race. I'm curious about this. Against the timer or some opponent? 
I guess, against Timer, but we'll see. And there's some Archer. We'll kill him. There you go. Kill the other one. Because he can be trouble later. I don't want you to be trouble. <laughs> and let's get in here. Hello there. Bad news, brother. I killed a Templar this morning. I suppose that's actually good news. I even found a letter on him which I gave to Namayir, who said he'd find you and deliver it. But from the look in your face, I suspect this hasn't happened. Go on then. Don't waste any more time with me. Seek Namayir and get that letter. Well, how can I find him? Oh, <laughs> this way. Apparently. Okay, there's another flag. I don't have time for it. I need to hurry. Let's jump through here. Get on a roof once again. How many knives do I have? Four. Oh, should be enough. Right. I can take this. Thank you. And soon I'll be there. I hope. One minute left. Not so much time to do this. Need to hurry. Come on. Come on, Altair. You can do this. Oh. It will be fine. I could have collected that flag without any issues. <laughs> but anyway. Hello. Uh, here, here. Take this. I've been looking everywhere for you. Now I can finally return to Masiaf. Last time I offered to do someone a favor. Oh come on, don't be like that. What did you find out? Oh man, so many different and hard to pronounce words. Just see, do you have any attachment? Jibar seem obsessed with destroying every written work in the city. View attachment. Oh, there's a there's a letter. We are close now, so the entire city will be purged. Okay. All right. Yeah, <laughs> may the father of understanding guide you, J. Jibar. Assassins come for me. Assassins comes for me, as he has the others. I do not fear death at his hands. Well, you should. You should be afraid. Anyway, let's do the merchant stand. Right now. Or where am I, actually? No, no, no. I would have to travel the whole city. You know, let's do the eavesdropping. I usually do it the last, but, you know... I don't want to travel across the whole city again, so I will do it right now. We'll just listen and find out what is going on. And well, again, has to go. Have to go through the roof. All right, all right. It's okay. Let's jump down here. What? What? Come on, seriously? Are you kidding me? What did I do wrong? I know they are more aware because what I did previously. I mean, I kill like two targets in here. Oh, come on, I hate this. You get stun locked into this attack when you don't counter properly. Come on, man. Well, I, I will get out of here. Bye. Help me, guys. Come on, anyone? <laughs> Probably not. I will do the big pocket challenge if I can lose them. First, I need to lose them first. That's what I wanted to say. Oh man, I'm getting stressed out. Yeah, this is so, man, time consuming. So many freaking guards. I mean, this is a stealth game. I kill like 100 soldiers in today's episode alone. I guess that's my rough count. Well, it's not that many, but. Oh, well, maybe it is, I don't know. But anyway, I cannot run from them. I will oh, come on. Get out of here. Go, go. I won't throw you in the stand. Maybe kill him too. Yeah, right. And you too. And now I can do the eavesdropping. No one will suspect me. That's good. 
What's in on the bench? Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Everything's fine. Okay, let's listen. I wish to see him. To hear him speak. It can be arranged. But we must be careful. There are still those who reject illumination. They would harm him. And they are ignorant and afraid. You seem sincere. But how do I know I can trust you? It hurts me to even hear you ask the question. Very well. We gather each day in the madrasa. He comes to speak and then leads us into the city that we might cleanse it. Could I join you then? Understand that it is a difficult path we walk. Our work demands sacrifice. I understand. Then come and meet with us. Let us see how strong you really are. All right. Chuber holds daily meetings within the ma madrasa. Did I pronounce it correctly? Probably not, but yeah, there you go. Oh, so many. <laughs> There's massacre <laughs> in there. Such a shame they didn't give me any choice. Oh, come on out here, climb. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna do the big pocket challenge right now. Good catch. Don't hurt yourself. We already got the maximum number of health or health or synchronization or how should I call it? Oh no, these these guys can get me in, into trouble once again. I still got a PTSD from the last episode about what happened. Let's listen to conversation and let's steal some letter or map or I don't know what. Let's see. We found the place. It's just as you described it. I suspect he'll want to deal with this himself and quickly. Best we say nothing to the others. A wise course of action. Truth be told, I'll be happy when this business is done. Soon, my friend, soon. Today should see the last of them put to torch. Boy, come here. You still have the letter I gave you? Yes. Go and deliver it then. You'll find the one it's meant for inside the madrasa. All right. Just be careful. I'll probably have to leave this place before I will do anything because they will um, blow my cover again. These guys, these half naked gentlemen. I will wait, probably. Come on, man. Go away. I will wait for you, alright? And yeah, which way are you gonna go? Oh, this way. All right. Carefully. Thank you. You didn't felt anything, right? I quite a letter which say Jubar should be within the garden. A garden. All right. Let's see. Let's see the letter. Let's read through it real quickly. Oh no. <laughs> Master Jubar, I fear your suspicions have been proven true. Yeah, below is a map that will lead you to her hiding place. She's your wife. Oh, your wife. Your wife? Alright. I'm sorry, the has come to this. It cannot be easy, but I'm certain you will do the right. You will do what is right. Your brother always. Hakim. Okay. Alright. Thank you, I guess. For this information and yeah yeah let's see interrogation or informant challenge let's do the interrogation it should go faster yeah it's just around the corner the investigation is complete but yeah they will not stop us oh there you are talking gibberish are you the same one as in every city? You look like them. Exactly. Are you twins or something? Brothers? Anyway, let's start the interrogation. Sees the poison you carry in your hearts and minds. 
He works to cast it out. Remove all texts from your homes and schools. Give them to us. They must be destroyed. Well, haha. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Why are you talking like this? Why are you spreading these cursed words? Man. Come on. They're showing books. Are you a of mine? No? They've never done anything good in the history. Why would you repeat the same mistake? No one that will attack you in here. This looks fine. Secluded enough, I guess. Come on. Come on. Attack me. There you go. Oh no, your friends. Your friends came. <laughs> oh, come on. How many more hits? Well, leave me alone, guys. Come on, guys. Jeez, you're strong. There you go. This is not the answer, my child. In this we agree. So speak and I may stay my blade. What is it your master intends? Why destroy all this knowledge? We lay the stones to build a road upon which soon all men will travel. It leads to a better tomorrow. That is not what I see. Then you are blind. The words upon these parchments, they are poison. Jubayer holds the cure. He'll free us from their lies. It's nonsense you speak. You've lost your mind. No, not lost, but found. I see the world for what it truly is. He has shown me so much. I am illuminated. Fanatic is all you are, and dangerous for it. Do what you must. It changes nothing. We are not afraid. You should be. You should be. Yeah. Well, you changed by the indoctrination into joking such a. Oh, nothing happened. Such meaningless thoughts. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. Anyway, let's do the assassination challenge. I should probably steal some some knives. Yeah, I will. Steal from this one. Slowly. There you go. Thank you. Got nine. Yeah, that's that's enough. Where are you exactly? Man. Where are you hiding? Oh there you are. my friend. You have become quite the wanted man, as am I. I must prepare my family for the trip back to the safety of Masayef this afternoon. Could you finish my last assignment in exchange for information? Some men must be eliminated in Jubair's quarter. Be fast, my friend. Okay, how many? Oh, five in five minutes. Oh, there's one. Why are you walking there? On the roof? Well, you'll be the first to die. I just need you to go into the other side. And not turn your back towards me. There you go. All right, now jump down. Where's the other one? Oh, I don't see too much. Oh, there you are. This golden boy, right in here. There are guards. Should be careful. No two rounds. Any suspicion? Nothing. I just want to kill this dude. Nothing. Nothing that interesting. All right. Steal some guards. Can I take you out? Oh no. Okay, okay. It worked fine. <laughs> they are too stupid. I didn't. Another one dead? You're not too observant, are you? Fortunately. <laughs> okay, two, two more. There's one. Well, it's not safe to kill you in front of them. They aren't too bright, but that would be pushing it too far. Maybe in here. 
There you go. Alright. Now be careful around here. And where's the last one? Where is the last one? Oh, there you are. No, no, don't you hit me. Where is that lunatic? There's these guys. This is filled with enemies. This is not too safe. I need to follow him somewhere else. Why are you attacking only me? This half naked dude. There you go. And and run. <laughs> Slowly run. Alright, and I'll just find No, no, no. Nothing. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Phew, that was a close go. We are done, mate. I must return to my family, but before I leave, this is for you. I found a map showing where scholars are planning to burn books and other sources of knowledge. Please be careful and let the future reunite us. I'll give your blessings to my family. Oh, thank you. I didn't bless anyone, but yeah, you can. You can give my blessings, I guess. It's okay. Oh, let's do the, the last one. Distraction. What did we find out? Acquired map detailing where Chibar will be burning books. Look for smoke. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. Let's see the map. Let's see. This is the map. And what are these? These are already burned or something like that. So four places or six? Gosh, you're still in here. I could maybe ask you. What does that mean, actually? Anyway, we'll find out. We are the best. Not me, Altairius. <laughs> but yeah. Let's do the last one. But carefully, because these guards are already triggered enough. Without me acting like a... Like a crazy person. So, yeah. Or like a child, thank you. Thank you for the insult. So yeah, where's the informant? Oh, why? <laughs> why did you grab air? For a reason. I wanted to grab the ledge, but didn't need to. So, oh, there you are. Altai, your name is on everybody's lips these days, and for once their words are kind. If you're truly a changed man, perhaps you'd be willing to do me a favor. Jubair has employed certain merchants to spy on the citizens for him. They feed him names in exchange for gold. You would be doing all the city a great service if you were to find these merchants and destroy their stalls. This should end their evil. Well, let's do this. All right. Sounds like a plan. Three merchants in three minutes. Oh, it should be fine. I'll take this flag with me. Oh, there's one stand. Just where I stand. Oh, that was a catch. Where's some guard who I can throw? Oh, this one. I'm sorry, I'm stupid and blind. There you go. And the second one is in here. So come on, guys. No, let them go. And this one, too. I need to grab him. No, not you. <laughs> not you, buddy. Come on, get up. Get up. There you go. And one more. One more. I'll have to throw you, throw you twice. Throw you twice. Come on. Get up. Get up. Get up. Now slowly. Because I don't want to waste my two minutes fighting with you. Okay, I will have to get... Couldn't you come to me, maybe? That would be easier than me climbing on a roof. Yeah, I have to do everything myself. By myself. But, okay, okay. There you are. You've done a good thing today, Altair. In exchange, I'll share my knowledge with you. Your target is likely to be dressed much like his followers. So here is how to distinguish him from the others. 
He wears rich golden robes and carries with him a large pouch. Find him, brother. Make him feel pain. Oh, I will make him feel pain. Don't you worry. Wears rich golden robes and carries a pouch. Okay. Well, that didn't help me too much. Well, maybe it did, but, you know. <laughs> we'll see soon enough. Well, let's go back to, to Rafik. As I find out, Rafik is not actually a name, but it's a, like a position. Well, you learn something a new day. It's like um, the headquarters master or something like that. Making sure you will get the right contracts and things like that. So anyway, Rafik. What news, Altair? I've learned much about my enemy. Share what you know then. Jubayer has become obsessed with purging the city of its knowledge. A most terrible crime. Now I see why Al Mualim wants you to remove him. He's using the city scholars to assist him. They go out into the streets, harassing the people and collecting all their written works. I fear he intends to destroy them all. He must be stopped. That's why I'm here. He's to hold a meeting soon at the Madrasa Al Qalasa. It's where I'll go. It's where I'll take his life. I'll leave you alone to prepare. Bring glory to the Brotherhood. I will try. I hope we'll. Will be better than the last time. I mean, I screwed up big time. The last mission. So, hopefully, be patient and pray. Everything will work fine. It's preparing for a meeting within that place. <laughs> I don't know how to how to read it. But, uh, well, it's pretty close. Should be fine. How many knives do I have? Or oh, ten. So I'll am I able to you know gain additional knives from the bureau or I'm not? I don't know, I'm I'm confused. <laughs> As always. Oh I have to go through the roof. That's new. That's new. Will there be a platform where I can catch? Myself, not catch something. Oh, someone is crying. Oh, it's already beginning. I'll be quiet. Every single text in this city must be destroyed. My friend, you must not do this. Much knowledge rests within these parchments, put there by our ancestors for good reason. And what reason is this? They are beacons, meant to guide us, to save us from the darkness that is ignorance. No, these bits of paper are covered in lies. They poison your minds, and so long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. How can you accuse these scrolls of being weapons? They are tools of learning. You turn to them for answers and salvation. You rely more upon them than yourselves. This makes you weak and stupid. You trust in words, drops of ink. Do you ever stop to think of who put them there? Or why? No, you simply accept their words without question. And what if those words speak falsely, as they often do? This is dangerous. You are wrong. These texts give the gift of knowledge. We need them. You love your precious writings. You do anything for them? Yes. Uh, yes, of course. Then destroy them! <laughs> any man who speaks as he is just as much a threat. Do any else among you wish to challenge me? Good. Your orders are simple enough. Go out into the city. Collect any remaining writings and add them to the piles in the streets. When you're done, we'll send a cart to collect them, that they may be destroyed. Okay, but... Yeah, which one 
is my target? That's the question. <laughs> oh man. Well, I, I said that those instructions were enough. Man in the golden robe. What does that even mean? Here. Can I jump? No. She found me. Alright. I will have to kill you in a fair fight. Come on. Guard break, which I have learned. Oh no. Come on. Don't you burn those books. They done nothing to you. Okay, come on. There you go. Yeah, you weren't on my target, apparently. This can take a long time. As it seems. We'll have to kill this one. Slowly. Slowly. And strike. <laughs> and the target is killed. Guards aren't alarmed good stuff somehow I avoided contact there's the other one I won't be able to get there guess I have to go through these guys can I jump on his head or something I will try I will try or like this like this slowly oh it was my main target nice why? Why have you done this? men must be free to do what they believe it is not our right to punish one for thinking what they do no matter how much we disagree then what you of all people should know the answer educate them teach them right from wrong it must be knowledge that frees them not force they do not learn fixed in their ways as they are you are naive to think otherwise. For which there is but one cure. You're wrong, and that's why you must be put to rest. Am I not unlike those precious books you seek to save? A source of knowledge with which you disagree, yet you are rather quick to steal my life. A small sacrifice to save many. It is necessary. Is it not ancient scrolls that inspire the Crusaders? that fills Salah Adin and his men with a sense of righteous fury. Their texts endanger others, bring death in their wake. I too was making a small sacrifice. It matters little now. Your deed is done. And so am I. Yeah, that, that's about it. Yeah, you... <laughs> basically commented how the situation is. Oh, come on, how did you saw me? I mean, this is one of those things I don't like about game. This game, I mean. That you cannot kill your targets stealthily, you know, and escape in a crowd. No, you can kill your targets like that, but that's about it, you know. You will have to escape with the whole city running after you oh man I'm being <laughs> pessimistic in today's episode We're talking about rebellion Assassin's Creed rebellion rebellion and talking about these things which I don't like get out of here oh, come on who showed me you did you did no, you did. Right. Now let's run. To the... Chords of action music. Or something. Come on. Come on, climb. Out here. Not a flag. Kill you as well. And... Can I continue moving on the rooftops? I think so. 
there are some platforms which I can use to get to the right side. There you go. Oh, this was the place I've been before. The spooks burning. Yeah, that was it. These guys wanted to kill me before. Might as well kill them now. And let's get back. Just a few more meters. Jump. Climb. And... We are almost there. Don't you fall down. Don't you fall down. Okay, mission complete. Right. Rafik. We did it. Altair, tell me you've met with success. Yes. Jubayer's fires are extinguished. His life as well. Excellent news. I had no doubt you'd succeed. You should have seen it. The scholars followed him so readily. It wasn't just books they fed to fire either, but any man who opposed them. Such ignorance breeds only evil. You've done a good thing this day. As with my other targets, he believed he was doing the right thing, clearing a path to a better future. Of course he would. Such is the landscape of a madman's mind. The things I've seen these past few weeks, it's as if all the land has gone mad. And this is why we fight to end the war, that sanity might return. The people are desperate for direction. It's easy for men like Jubayer to prey on this and turn them towards evil. You should go, Altair. Return to Al Mualim. Tell him what you saw. Let him know the good you've done this day. Safety and peace, Rafi. Upon you as well. Thank you, my friend. I will go. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. I sure will. I just gonna rest for a bit. Target has been um eliminated. Gosh. Let's return back. Fast forward memory to Masyaf. Yes, please. Welcome home, child. What news? Another of the named is put to rest. Then it would appear your work is nearly complete and your status restored. A question, Master, if I may. Ask and I will answer. Why these men, Jubayer and Sabrand? Ah, don't you see? They paved the way for change. Ensure threats both old and new are not given cause to intervene. To weaken them is to weaken our enemy. I suppose that makes sense. Were these men to continue their work, our work would quickly be undone. How is that? We've caused them much grief. We strike at the arms, yes. But this is a hydra that you face, and it is quick to replace that which is severed. Then we should lop off its head and be done with this. Soon, soon. We are close. Only one more man stands between us and our ultimate goal. I will return to my work. The sooner this last man dies, the sooner I might face our true enemy. Before you go, I have a question for you. Of course. What is the truth? We place faith in ourselves. We see the world the way it really is, and hope that one day all mankind might see the same. What is the world, then? An illusion. One which we can either submit to, as most do, or transcend. What is it to transcend? To recognize nothing is true and everything is permitted that laws arise not from divinity but reason. I understand now that our creed does not command us to be free. It commands us to be wise. Do you see now why the Templars are a threat? Whereas we would dispel the illusion, they would use it to rule. Yes, to reshape the world in an image more pleasing to them. That is why I sent you to steal their treasure. That is why I keep it locked away. And that is why you kill them. So long as even one survives, so too does their desire to create a new world order. Take your equipment. Seek out this last man. With his death, Robert de Sable will at last be vulnerable. It will be done. Safety and peace upon you, Altair. Thank you, Master. Thank you very much. What do you have for me? What do I get? New blade, short blade expertise, damage, right? Nice things. Okay, I gotta pause it. I already recording too much, so 
So thank you kindly for watching this video, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. I hope you had fun and I will hope to see you next time. So stay healthy, stay safe and God bless. Bye bye. And Raven out.